Hi everyone, welcome back to Offbeat Psychology for Offbeat Information. If you are new here, let me tell you, my name is Tanishka and I make videos related to psychology. So this channel is all and everything related to psychology, about psychology. If you are new to this channel and if you are a psychology lover like me, I highly recommend you hit that subscribe button so that you get all important information related to my videos. Alright, in today's video, I would be telling you about the best books for ISC psychology. If you are someone who has taken psychology at plus 2 level, you must be aware there are certain books recommended by the council. The council does not prescribe a particular single book for psychology. That is to encourage a student to do reference work in psychology. So, if yes, psychology if taken at plus 2 level, then it does require you to do more hard work than other subjects. So that is one downside of taking psychology which I personally feel because not everybody would like to do reference work. For some it could be a good thing, for some it could be a bad thing. It totally depends. And teachers across India have been using different different books for psychology, for teaching psychology to their students. Now this video is all about the best books. These are based on my personal opinion. And I am myself an ISC examiner. So I know which are the books and... So let me just quickly start by telling you the first one is this one. Uh, this is Psychology by Robert A. Barron. This is when I was a student and I am totally in love with the subject since the time I have taken this subject. It amazes me every time and this book is definitely a very good book. This is the older edition. The newer edition is uh, I think a red color book. Yes, so you can buy the newer edition also, but if you find the older edition, I highly recommend you get that one because that is much more better. This book is really good. The language of this book is easy. The only thing is it's a little bit pricey. If you have already planned that you want to make a career in psychology, then I would suggest that you can buy all the books which your teacher recommends because that will be like an investment in the field of psychology. But if you are not decided whether you want to take up psychology in future or not, then you can choose either of the books that I am going to tell you. Now, the second one is Morgan and King. So, Morgan and King, this is the one, this is my copy. So, this is the one which I have and uh, it's covered in newspaper as you can see. This one is also very, very good uh, for studying psychology at plus two level. Uh, I personally feel that this book has a little bit difficult language. This book is also expensive. Uh, all the books which I am telling you about are available easily online as well as offline. And if you feel they are a little bit more pricey, uh, then you can do one thing. You can probably go and take a second hand one which will be available in almost all the markets uh, near you. Any book market you will find all these books very easily. Now the third one is for those students who do not wish to do reference work for psychology. Yes, there is only one book which I feel is very comprehensive. It's this book. It's a good one. It's uh, ISC Psychology by Chaya Prakashini. It's a very, very good book. I've also met the author of this book. Very good book. If you don't wish to do reference work, if you wish to save your time, then you can use this book. So this is class 11 one. You will get a class 12 one. When you get promoted to 12, you can buy the 12 one also. The next book which I would like to recommend to you is Educational Psychology by S.K. Mangal. I don't have that book right here with me. I think I left it at my workplace. So yes, that is one excellent, excellent book. It is by an Indian author and it's a little bit cheaper than these books. Uh, the Chaya one is cheaper actually. But uh, yes, S.K. Mangal by Educational Psychology is one book that you can use at plus two level, at uh, your graduation level and even at your master's level. That's a very, very good book. And, and my last recommendation is this book. This is Psychology by S.K. Cicilleri. Okay, I think that's the pronunciation of the name. Uh, so, now this one and the Baron book are the ones which are recommended by the council. But you can study from either of these. I have read this book. I don't personally like it. I feel the language is not that easy to understand, especially for a beginner. So choose accordingly and choose wisely. See which is the one which fits your budget. You can find these books easily on Amazon. 
that's from where i prefer buying books otherwise offline also any book market you can find any of these because these are readily available one downside with the chaya book is it's mostly out of stock online and offline also it's not available in all the places as far as i know so that's one thing you have to keep in mind so be sure that uh, if you want to buy the chaya book online uh, just uh, you know click on notify me when something is out of stock you can click on that and later on whenever the book is in stock you can buy all right that was it for today's video i hope you enjoyed watching this video if you did this share this with your other friends and family members so that they will also know about the best books which you can use to study psychology thank you so much for watching and please subscribe to my channel if you like the content of this channel